Alright Trey, this is it. Today is the day you finally defeat Curtis and Tekken. You bet sis, I've been training hard for this moment. Oh man, Curtis is not playing around with martial law. He's so fucking hard to defeat. Yeah, Curtis really knows how to take advantage of lost speed and agility. It's not going to be an easy match for Troy. I can't fucking keep up with Curtis. He's on another level. Don't give up, Troy. You've got this. And there you have it, folks. Curtis's martial law takes the win in an intense matchup against Troy as Shaheen. What a damn good game, Jackie Chan wannabe. You really know how to bring it in Tekken. Round one. Fight. Troy, why are you getting so upset about losing to Curtis and Tekken 8? It's just a game. But he's fucking undefeated. I can't stand losing to him over and over again. It's fucking frustrating. I understand that it can be frustrating, but remember, it's just a game. Curtis has spent a lot of time practicing and improving his skills. I know, but it's fucking embarrassing to keep losing like this. I wish I could just beat his ass once. Have you tried changing your strategy? Maybe try different characters or practice more with Shaheen to counter martial law's moves. Oh, 
I've fucking tried everything, but Curtis always seems to know what I'm going to do next. It's like he's one step ahead of me all the time. Well, I even tried playing against Curtis as Lily, and I couldn't defeat him either. Maybe we should just appreciate his skills and enjoy the game without focusing too much on winning or losing. I guess you're right. It's just hard to accept defeat when Curtis is so good at this game. Better look next time, Troy. have fun playing together and not worry too much about who wins or loses. After all, it's the time spent together that matters the most. You're right, Sarah. Thanks for helping me see things differently. Let's enjoy the game and have a good time, my baby sister.